Hello, I am Ralph Sanchez, author of The Diabetic Brain and Alzheimer's Disease. And today on the 5-Minute Bark, I'm going to be sharing some terrific information about what may be your risk for Alzheimer's disease. You know, one of the uh, things that uh, you and I had talked about before was um, dietary approaches. And there's one that everybody has probably heard of. It's called the Mediterranean diet, right? And the Mediterranean diet has been well established as, um, you know, a model for preventing uh, heart disease and diabetes. And they've done some research in terms of its correlation to lower incidence of Alzheimer's disease as well, too. So much so that a, a researcher put the Mediterranean diet and another diet that's uh, modeled for um, stopping hypertension, it's called the DASH diet. And she took both of those diets and created what's called the MIND diet. And in the MIND diet, there's a whole profile of healthier foods. And we all know what those healthier foods are. You know, lots of vegetables, especially salads. You know, those leafy greens are very, very rich in certain what are called uh, phytochemicals, plant chemicals, okay? And those plant chemicals are really important for the prevention of heart disease and diabetes and Alzheimer's disease. So getting lots of vegetables, berries, are absolutely the top fruit and maybe the top food that actually gives you that kind of uh, nurture, you know, that kind of nutrition that's really important for your brain. So we're talking about brain foods. So leafy greens, berries, a little wine, so you can have fun, nuts, fantastic food. And what you want to stay away from is uh, too much sugar. Okay, so too much sugar increases your risk for Alzheimer's disease and diabetes, and they're linked, as we talked about. So um, the sugar aspect and what we call refined carbohydrates. So anything that you know comes in a package is a refined carbohydrate. So whole grains, if you don't have a problem with gluten, are fine. You know. Uh, but you want to stay away from lots of uh, refined uh, breads and crackers and too much pasta and fast food. All of that stuff is not going to help. 